Hello everyone, welcome again. In this Jira Cloud tutorial, we will learn how you can delete a task or issues in Jira. Now before we get into any of the Jira project and try to delete the issues, you need to understand that when you are working in any project and you are not getting the option that I'm showing in this particular tutorial to delete the issue, the possibility might be because you do not have permission to delete the issues within those projects. So in Jira, there are a lot of permissions that are given to you when you are working in a project uh, as part of the project member. So if you uh, if your role is uh, such that you are not allowed to delete any issues, you won't get these options to delete the issues, right? But uh, if you are able to see these options, then you uh, might have been given the permission to delete the issue. Most of the times you will have the delete permission for the tasks that you create or subtasks that you create, you will be having the permission to delete those. Now let's start from the classic Scrum project in Azure Cloud. So deleting uh, the issue or a task in Jira is very simple process. So for example, here, if I am on the uh, in, in the backlog and I want to delete any of the issue that is shown here. So uh, the simplest way is to basically say, for example, I want to delete this task one. I can simply select that, just highlight it, click on it and click on the right uh, three ellipses right inside three ellipses ellipses it will show actions and then click on this delete link here if you click on the delete it will give you um, you are about to permanently delete this issue this warning will come up and all of the data and the attachments for this particular issue will get deleted if you click on press delete so for example if i press delete then the task one has been deleted right now deleting a user story or any other bug is also similar. Okay, so if I want to silly, uh, delete this bug uh, user registration using Twitter account, then I can simply click on these three ellipses and click on delete. The other option is there is a shortcut. So you can simply highlight the issue and press the dot icon uh, dot on your keyboard and this operation will open up. So operation window will open up and it will show you which issue will be worked upon. So RT8 has been selected, right? So here from the drop down, you can select the delete option. So there are many options. This is the shortcut that you can use. You can choose the, uh, you know, workflow options there or the action. So within the action, uh, you will, you know, have the delete option there. So you can select the delete option and you just click on this delete button and that defect got deleted, right? So this is how you will delete the issues from Jira. The other way is simply right click, right? So in the backlog, simply right click on the issue and you will see the option, delete option to delete the issue on the particular, in the particular backlog. All right. So these are a couple of ways to delete the issue. If you are in the issue details, say for example, I open RT1 in the detail window here. Now from this detail view as well, I can simply click on this actions ellipses and click on delete to delete this particular RT1 test story. So if I click on delete, that story will get deleted right so this is some error that occurs because uh, this is not handled properly and uh, because we were on the issue detail page and we already deleted that so that issue itself is not available so that link became invalid and that is why this error is being displayed so simply close it and that story got deleted so these are a couple of ways that you can utilize to delete the issues from the classic scrum project similarly if we go to the classic kanban project there is nothing different deleting issues is exactly same in the classic kanban project as well so we can highlight the issue we can you know select the issue uh, go to the actions and click delete to delete the issue right and 
then if we go to the next gen project so let's go to the next gen scrum project in the next gen scrum project if i simply click on these three ellipses so i'm on the board at the moment so you simply click on the three ellipses and you will get the option to delete that particular issue directly all right or you simply right click on the issue and you will get the delete option so either you hover over the issue click on the ellipses or you simply right click on the issue and click on delete and it will pop up the same window to delete the issue right so this is about the next gen scrum project from the backlog as well you can also navigate you will get the same options simply right click or uh, right click is not working in this particular case in the backlog uh, let me go back uh, from the ellipses you can click on the three ellipses and click on delete right uh, from the story details as well you go to the actions and click on delete so many options to delete the issues from jira project so this is about next gen scrum project if we go to the next gen kanban it will be almost similar so not much difference so navigation wise and in terms of where they have provided or where atlassian has provided the buttons and uh, operations to perform or to perform delete operation on the issues it's almost similar so for example this particular issue on the board if i want to delete simply click on the ellipses click on delete or right click click on delete if i want to go to the details issue detail i can go to the actions and delete it or i can go to the actual you know completely open the new window for this particular issue and then go to the actions in the right hand side three ellipses and delete this issue all right so that's how i will be working or uh, deleting the issues from the next gen kanban project similarly if i go to the backlog i can also delete the issues from the backlog by simply clicking on these three ellipses and deleting the issues from the direct backlog as well all right so this is all about how you can delete the issues from jira projects and we have understood how uh, you know there are various uh, projects different types of projects that we have gone through and what all options are available what all shortcuts are available in order to delete the issues from jira projects so that's all for this particular tutorial hope you like it please do share and subscribe and thank you for watching